Can't you tell me how long you'll be in there? No. Really? Is it your father? No, 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 no. He's still all right. Well, good. That's that's it's a relief, right? Definitely, definitely a big relief. It was sweet of you to track me down to check, though. Well, actually, I was uh, I was here to. Jake. Uh, listen, uh, I'm really busy right now. Well, can't so you spare me even one single second, even to talk about my father? Look, you guys go ahead. I'm. Laura's waiting. Laura. Did you see Laura? Yeah, she she uh, she asked to see me. Why? That's what I'm here to find out. Watch out for chloroform bottles and laundry carts. <laughs> okay, I'll open. Listen, uh, the last I heard, your father's condition is continuing to improve. But if we want a more detailed report, you're going to have to see Hayward. Now, I don't need a doctor, Jake. I need you. Jake, you can't still be mad at me for crashing Leo's rehearsal dinner. Why? Everything turned out the way it was supposed to. Do you really think that's true? If I didn't think everything turned out for a reason, I'd go crazy. You are the new and improved Greeley Smythe. I don't know about that. <laughs> One thing's for sure. No matter what happens, we'll always feel the same way about each other. Greeley, if you guys are all finished, do you mind if I take you away from here for a little bit? You and me? No, no, go ahead. Actually, I'm still on duty here, remember? Jake! Jake, he, he hurt his hand. Oh. No, what happened? I, I, I think he needs stitches. Grinley, now look at it. Okay. All right. Okay, well, let's, let's get you to radiology here and we'll get some pictures, okay? Okay. They weren't red, they were yellow. Which is not the floor it signal. Green, I just really had to talk to you. Like, <laughs> immediately. This is the car we had heat. Why am I beginning to think this was planned? Because it was. <laughs> so you lured me to this boathouse for nefarious purposes? No, this place does, definitely does have some memories, doesn't it, Greenley? been a scene for some major moments, that's for sure. Will this be another major moment? Well, that's pretty much up to you. You look cold. Why don't you come over here? Leo, it's cruel to keep me in suspense. Get to the major part. <laughs> <laughs> you are definitely unique, Greenlee. You're impatient, you're spontaneous, and you are definitely resourceful. Am I getting an award? Yeah, and I got the soggy tux to prove it. Sprinkler system to get out of the air duct, not to stop your wedding. Yeah, and that was probably the most refreshing shower I've had since, well, the mid 80s at least. <laughs> well, I could have doused you a long time ago if I'd known it'd do you any good. Really, please, just let me have it. I've been so mean to you for so long. Please, it'll at least, you know, make me feel a little less guilty. We've been through this, Leo. We both made mistakes. Personally, I've perfected the art. How is Laura? You never said. Surprisingly good. She's actually coming around. Really? Yeah. How so? Well, I think she gets it that, that she and I never had what it took to make a marriage. You're kidding. No. No more scheming, mind games, court orders. You're free man. I guess miracles do come true. You know, I first realized that when I was at the altar in front of Laura and uh, Reverend Baker was probably... heaven's me. opened up? No, 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 this happened before the water. You know, I was about to say I do when this, this fantastic image just appeared and chased the words right out of my mind. Do I ask? She was a vision with soft brown hair, completely covering her from head to toe. The gorilla of my dreams. What a knockout. <laughs> Comedian. <laughs> you 
seriously, Greenlee. When I saw you as Mrs. Kong, I knew that I had to have that in my life. Me? Monkeying around? Yeah, well, sort of. Things are just more interesting when you're around. Most people just find me irritating. Yeah, well, it's a good thing that I'm not most people. I'm just a guy who's crazy in love with the girl in the gorilla suit. Did you hear what I said? You just said I do, except the gorilla got in the way. Oh, not just any gorilla, Grandma. I want to hear it again. I, Leo Dupre, love you, Granny Smythe. Go on. Go on? Yeah, when I imagined it, there was more to it. Oh. Uh... I was an idiot forever thinking that I could live my life without you? <laughs> yes! <laughs> That's almost exactly how I heard it hundreds of times where I couldn't sleep at night. Yeah, well, I can't promise to make up for lost time or sleep, but... I can promise to do things right from here on. Go for it. Okay. But I can't go it alone, so here. <laughs> Will you please marry me, Greenlee? 